So I switched between Windows 11 and Zorin OS 18 for two weeks. And honestly, the difference is wild. If you're tired of ads, forced updates, or just want your laptop to feel faster, yeah, watch this first. Hey, I test operating systems, so you don't have to. Today, real talk, Windows 11 versus Zorin OS 18, performance, apps, gaming, privacy, all in under two minutes. Let's go. Windows 11 is smooth to install, but man, it really wants you online. Microsoft account, OneDrive, telemetry, all baked in. Zorin OS, boot a live USB, click install and you're in. Local account, fewer nags, and it just feels lighter out of the box. Windows 11 looks great, but keeps sneaking ads into start and search. Zorin's layout is clean, and you can switch between Windows style and Mac OS style in one click. Plus, Zorin Connect lets you sync Android notifications and files instantly. That's a win. If you rely on Adobe MS Office macros or heavy gaming, Windows still wins, but for coding, writing, or general productivity, Zorin feels faster, quieter, and more in control. It uses fewer background services and gives you full control over updates and privacy. Windows nails compatibility and anti-cheat. Zorin with Steam Plus Proton runs most games great, but not all. Battery life's close. Windows is slightly better on tuned laptops. Zorin pulls ahead on older ones. If you want maximum compatibility and gaming, stick with Windows. If you want speed, privacy, and peace, Zorin OS 18 is honestly one of the best Linux desktops right now. So yeah, you don't have to ditch Windows completely. Try Zorin from a USB, see if it clicks. Hit like if this helped. Subscribe for more Linux versus Windows tests. And I'll see you in the next one.